Hey guys. Welcome to Couple. Please like and subscribe if you like the video. President Donald Trump pulls two starburst candies out of his suit jacket pocket and throws them on the table in the direction of German Chancellor Angela Merkel. Here, Angela, he says, don't say I never give you anything. This scene, from day two of the G7 summit in Canada this past June, was an apt metaphor for the strained relations between the two nations since Trump came to power. For America's president, the relationship with our closest European allies is all about trade imbalances, unfair, and military spending, too low. For baffled German officials, the question has been how to deal with an erratic leader who contradicts, and often fires, his staff, changes his mind willy-nilly, lies with impunity, and goes out of his way to offend America's friends while flattering autocrats in countries like Russia and North Korea. Germany's answer, Wunderbar together. The effort includes more than 1,000 cultural events across 50 states, from film screenings and democracy discussions to a Wunderbus. That's the slogan for an epic charm offensive and pro-democracy campaign the German government is mounting in the United States starting in October. The Year of Germany in the US, a $20 million effort, will be announced on Saturday in Berlin. Spanning 15 months, it will include more than 1,000 cultural events across 50 states, ranging from film screenings and democracy discussions to the Wunderbus, a mobile diplomatic mission that will stop at some six dozen American schools and engage students in building Bauhaus miniatures. We want to reach the children and the elderly, explains Christoph Mutcher, a director with the Goethe Institute who is in charge of implementing the campaign. Bauhaus is a big hit everywhere. There will also be parties and yes lots and lots of beer. Germany has undertaken such efforts in the past. Since reunification, there has been a tradition of representing political, economic, and cultural interests abroad under the title The Year of Germany, in countries such as China or Brazil, Mutcher says. Last year, he was part of a team that staged about 1,000 events in Mexico, 